Hi Aries, welcome to this Tower Love reading. My name's Sophia. Welcome to this community. So what I was getting was, I remember your last reading and it was a lighter energy. This one I'm feeling, I don't think you know what this is, but it's, and this could be your person Aries, but I feel it's you. Something to do with, get is getting you into your emotional state. So I feel you might be at the moment, could be your person Aries, feeling emotional. So you, um, it's kind of making you think about love, not just your person. Um, it is emotionally connecting because it is kind of connected with the last reading um, because I think there was people telling you what to do, which you may presume is love in. But this is like the energy shifted to the heart space. So now you're actually knowing what love is. So you could be like, oh, right. Okay. This could be in any situation, right? It could be, oh, I recognize that my children do love me. I, do, I recognize that my my parents do love me. Or, or you recognize how much it is the differences they're saying. So there's something you took for granted. And you didn't realize that loving situation. Let me give another example. So you might have went to one job, which um, they maybe they pushed you to do more hours or something like that. And you didn't like it, something like that. So you went to an easier option job. And there's a reflection kind of an emotional state here that's making you think, well, I get it now, and that's why that was love, or this person loved me more, something like that, <clears throat> now it could be your person, and you're comparing X to your person, it, I, I don't know, I feel it's a general, it's putting you into the emotional <clears throat> state, so there's a there's a learning path coming here for you, because initially, like I said, I feel, it, it, they're making you aware of people and things that you do with the easier option, and and that don't serve you now it's making you emotionally connect to the people who do serve you that's what i feel with this so you're in your emotional state i'm getting could be a bit teary um a bit something like that may some of you might be a bit stuck aries something like that yeah i don't feel action though just it, in that heart space so let's see what this is what's going on here oh if you're new hello welcome i have a facebook group you get free extended readings i've put out a libra uh, moon retrograde reading because libra is in you know in the moon retrograde whatever normally you'll get them in free in the facebook group but it's a very important one that's why i've released it on the channels uh, you get free extended readings, uh, like planetaries, like I just said, uh, pick a cards. I give more extra additional information there <clears throat> because YouTube's too big and too out there. Uh, anyone, you know, your mum can come on here and do a video and her, with her mum knitting. You know, it's just too open. I want a group of people who, who want serious about changing this planet and getting their person. It's too, 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 it's like switching on telly, you know, and just watching me is not enough. You know, it doesn't make you do anything. That's why I created the group. It's free to grow, join and it's a private group. <clears throat> it's all in the description box. So let's jump in, Aries. I might be doing a live on there as well. I, oh, I'm getting pulled to do a live. I haven't done a live. You can ask me questions as well. Towers here. Mm. okay oh so this is why you're going within aries let's see what's going on with your person as well so high priestess don't really get this much um high priestess come out the star and the tower okay so the high priestess is what i said about i feel this energy of going within um going into your emotional state i didn't really feel it as the heart how, how can i explain that it's kind of teaching you real love without you going, oh, how can I explain that? Without you going into the heart space. 
it's not like okay i put it another way it's not like you're opening up your heart because i feel you're already an open-hearted person you're very loving nurturing caring you naturally so it's not about making you to be more of that it's like it's putting you on your path to use that correctly something like that which i get because the high priestess is in the middle of this path the one one eleven right the path and that's what i feel i feel there is a there's something about feeling excluded yet yeah, it's like there's two parts of you and you're it's trying to put you together i don't this is what i'm getting I, 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 no, I'm getting a lot from this card. It's something like not maturing, but kind of growing you into your true self. It's like you was brought up, um, <clears throat> say you was brought up and you was a bit of a, a comedian. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. So at school, say you was messing about playing the Joker of something in the classroom right and now you're older and this spirituality life has come on to you it's like you don't know how to combine them is this is what i just get it's like it's balancing out the black and the white the, the 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 which is temperance is underneath it which balances out differences that's why i class temperance the twin flame card because your person you think is it balances out the impossibilities the differences the things that you think oh well my person will never come towards me they'll never quit drink they never leave that third party that's what temperance does so this is actually working on you of balancing out because i think these two aspects of yourself makes you insecure both of them in the i know a different reading i don't know what to say both of them in their different right and this is kind of like connected with the last one it was a bit you know weird anyway both my sons and aries anyway both of them in their own right so say if you're in this and i'm not saying you're a joker messing around person i'm giving an example of a character say when you're out there in world and you're you know the 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 you know <clears throat> messing about joker friendly not you know nothing harmful character and then there's then you come home and you get into this spirituality tarot whatever character it's like you don't know how to put them both together <clears throat> that's what i don't know and they're helping you to do it and because you don't know and both of them are elements of you it's making you insecure and borderline depressed star why i'm saying all that is because next to it is a star which is healing you to be your main superstar to be your true self it's like it's stripping you back and you see the star cars naked it's strict stripping you back to restart who you are because the woman's naked so she's born you know you're born naked so it's stripping you back to restart of who you will be both elements of yourself here so that's what this is and this is like i said i didn't feel it was like opening up your heart space or anything like this but this is inner work intuition inner work insight inner knowing inner work and the star is the planets are helping you to align yourself the tower is about your foundation the found this is all about inside and your body because the tower is your foundation and your foundation your physical body is a foundation as well so this is working inside your body to for you to be a better version of yourself and it's like because sometimes you can get into darkness this is coming out of this ego self and yeah that's what the, the, the seahorse to me represents ego i don't know why maybe i read it somewhere it's done out ego too but that's the twin flame light worker journey coming out of that ego into oneness of self the dove the union uh, the the dove is rep the bird the feathers that that that's all the divine self so it's making you to be your true star seed self so you're kind of waking up here like a phoenix rising 
and you could be it's kind of i've just got to say it's a bit weird it might be you going for a kind of dark night of the soul because you it's it's weird because the energy i'm getting it is rising but you're dark at the same time so this could be one minute you're fine and one minute you're not one day you're fine one minute one day you're not because it's pulling you out and it's trying to align you like i said the two aspects of self it doesn't want to take you away from that character of the identity of the ego self that's the 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 the, the conscious of um you know the one percent but it's trying to make you more divine with the stars the planets who you are why you are here as a star seed it's your time to shine let's say with a star right and i think you've you're dabbling on bits of other things is putting you together. This is divine now. This is divinely time for a reason or something. So like I said, with the temperance is about having patience whilst you're going through this transformation. This reading will make you understand why you're going through it. Temperance is balancing out the two parts. Of, like I said, it's weird. It's like there's two parts of you being put together in one body. And it's balancing out the, 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 the negative and positive. When I say the negative and positive with the two pillars here, it doesn't mean you have negative aspects of you. It's just, it's, it's like there's some purpose, there's massive, a massive purpose for you, which you know. But it's like it's balancing out, I, I don't know how to say it, because it's, it's galactic stuff upstairs. But that's what it's doing. So it's having patience while this, you're going through this dark night of the soul, is what I'm saying. And maybe your person's going through this on their version of it at this time as well. This is manifestation of you to become your better self. Underneath the star, the page of pentacles. Mm. There's something here about the ego of... I'll be honest, now, this is for you to actually know if this is you. You know, you got you, some people, when I say things, oh, that ain't me, and they react with reptilian. I'm like, well, I, I, I'm just telling you the reading, right? There's an element of you that you was out there, for example, say you was a tower reader, or you was a speaker, or you was a Reiki healer. There was an arrogance of you doing that, that you could nail your person, something like that. Say, I'll give my example. Say I'm just up here doing tower reading and there was like, well, I know my person's going to be with me because star, this is what I'm supposed to do, tarot. So as I'm divinely guided to do tarot, then my person is going to come live with me, is going to marry me. There was some kind of, and I don't think you put it in the arrogance or a way like that, but literally, yes, there was an arrogance of it, of the physical world was going to mould round you because you were a starseed light worker twin flame. And that just left you out in the cold. It's like, uh, no. So they're breaking down that foundation of that element. It's like it served you well, but now you have to understand basically it's work. Five of Pentacles to the Tower. That foundation that you make of yourself needs to crumble. Sorry, I had to pause it. I thought my door was knocking. Um, here as well, there's a bit of anger. Hmm. There's something about being left out in the cold. So at the moment now, you could be left out of the cold. So you're feeling a bit angry. Why are you out in the cold, though? I'll just say, you put yourself there. That's what I got from them. You put yourself out in the cold. It's about putting yourself in situations that leave you out in the cold. There's something about looking at things properly here with a tower yeah it's like your version of helping people it's not actually helping 
but you have the heart to want to help, but it keeps putting you out in the cold. Yeah, there's an arrogance of I'm connected with source. I, 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 there's something here that you think that's enough. It's like, well, that should just bring me. I'm telling you what I do with my image reading. I don't think anyone does. I can't find anyone. Someone sent me, said they'd done it before, ages ago. And I researched, well, I went on to the person. She said, oh, I've had an image reading before. I was like, oh, okay, can you tell me who it is? Because I've never heard of it. And, and, uh, you know, I, they just told me, and I just do this image reading, right? And I went to the guy, I couldn't, I was like, are you sure you had an image? I couldn't figure it out. I didn't even, he didn't even say image reading, so she said she had an image reading. I had never heard of it. But that's like me going out there, listen, I'm the best. No one does image readings. I do image readings, so I am better than everyone else. Now, that's over the top, but there's an something here that you felt you had that and it's you're correct because you're star but it was too much in the ego it made you out in the cold because you wasn't doing the physical work it's like yeah me saying oh i'm an image reading just come to me because obviously i've got this divine special image reading stuff and expecting people just coming to me because of i've got that there's something like that with this reading where it's like uh, they're wiping. It's like, yes, you we get it. That is you. But we're wiping away the ego part of it. It's, that's what he's getting here. It's two faced. It's two faced. And you need to know the physicality because the page of pentacle is physical and physical is hard work. <laughs> right. Is that's what it is. Pentacles get money is hard work. So now you're a student at it. And it's something, like I said, money. Maybe you wasn't getting any money, which made you left out in the cold. And you could have went into depression because you're like, well, where's my money? I've got this gift. I feel different. And listen that. And where's my money? Right? Because Five of Pentacles is lack of money. And it's like, well, yeah, because you have to be a student. How to get the money? <laughs> something like that. I've got this gift. I've got this community. I've got... Soulmate community, Twin Flame community, New Earth community, I've got mission, I've got programs, I've now got this Facebook group. I still have to go through the same Twin Flame, because I'll do that because not everyone likes that title, Twin Flame journey as you. That's it. We all have the same thing. That's when people say, oh, I'm a spiritual leader, I can heal you, vanity. You see, they might have, like Abraham Hicks, Talks about getting into the vortex. Oh, that's all you got to do. Get into the vortex. Something like that, right? And all loving and light and very lovely and, and, and presentable and tries to do jokes and all this kind of thing. I'm just saying, right? And But it that needs to crumble because she needs to pull back from her ego and say, who have I changed their life? Who has written to me and said, you have changed my life. I got into the vortex. I got married to a man who I wanted to. I got all the money from going into the, you know, that don't work. That's, that's a version of what's going on here. It's not literally you're going out there showing off. There's an ego element of you being like Adrian Hicks and it's not doing nothing. So they're wiping that foundation tower moment slash dark night of the soul for you to be who you truly are. Then you will get pentacles instead of uh, a student page of pentacles so you have to learn how to do this gift because there's a page of pentacles on top of the start you have to learn about this star seed you have to learn about it you see that's what this is about so if you want to learn about it book me right go into this facebook group it's free join this community everyone else is like i learn from you you learn from me that's what this community is this is about collaborating as a team. So if you want to do that, the link's in the description box. I'll just go straight to my website and book me and I can help you get you onto your way, onto your path, right? And you know that intuition here. Okay, I'm out. Speak to you later.